Til að kynna mér arkitektúr og hönnun borgar hennar hitti ég arkitektin og hönnuðin Melanie Corrie Ferrini sem fer fyrir skissuferðum um borgina. Í þeim lærir fólk að rissa upp það sem fyrir augum ber. Melanie heldur því fram að með því að skissa fremur að taka myndir tökum við betur eftir umhverfi okkar. Ég er ekki frá því að sér rétt hjá henni Melanie. So the easiest way to think about sketching is just to think about shapes, geometry. So let's start by sketching one shape at a time. So we're going to shape, sketch uh, boxes, basically. So let's sketch the first box, which on, is which on the left. And we're sketching the Smith Tower, which was built in 1914. Good, because you're looking at the shapes. So let's finish this shape here, which I love how you've done that. And everybody has their own unique style for sketching. So in perspective sketching, you just kind of make things look like they're more dimensional by going up and then down, right? And then this next one up and then down. And sketching a building really helps you really think about the architecture. On the Smith Tower, we see a lot of ornamentation on the top of the building, which was very true to that period of architecture. So when people walk in downtown Seattle, and particularly Pioneer Square, they should really look up because you can see a lot of the ornamentation at the top of buildings. And so by sketching them, you really think about the ornamentation as well. And it's really up to each individual as to what they want to detail. Mm. Maybe you think the windows are really cool and important. Maybe I think the tower is cool and important. Yeah, so I'm going to detail that more. <laughs> <laughs> so this is Pioneer Square. Why is it called Pioneer Square? It's called Pioneer Square because this was really the main spot that the pioneers came to start industry. After they left Alki Beach, which was where they started, and that's across the water here, yeah. um, they came to really um, where you see Seattle now because there was more activity. It was easy to start a business here. Yeah. Manufacturing, they started the uh, lumber industry over here. And uh, Yesler was a big part of that. And you see the Yesler Street, and you see Yesler in a lot of our buildings and streets in Seattle. Yeah. And, and Yesler was the person who started the first um, lumber mill here. And lumber was big in the Northwest, as it still is. Yeah. And it really produced a lot of uh, the wood that were used in the houses throughout the United States. The rail cars would come and pick it up yeah. and take it throughout the United States. Yeah. So Pioneer Square is really the pioneering area of Seattle. That's why they call it that. Where we're right now, there's a lot of people that gather here. A lot of different uh, types of people of the city come here. They have art walks in Pioneer Square. Pioneer Square is very known for its arts now. Yeah, and this is a great there. place to sketch. And the uh, totem poles, because Seattle and, and Washington has a very uh, rich history in uh, Native yeah. American culture. So they've integrated um, some of that in Pioneer Square as well, because that to Seattle is a very important part of our history. And, and Seattle, the name Seattle was named after uh, Chief Seattle. So that's what the name comes from. <laughs> See, I never put people in mind, because, <laughs> because I'm an architect. I'm like, people? <laughs>